in all the years it was hard that we kept getting shot down, actors passing, 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 you'd be an idiot if you didn't at least consider that maybe it's not as good as you think it is. Now, I believed this was hilarious, but there's a little part of you thinking, well, why is everybody passing, you know? I had a roommate at the time, a guy named Jimmy Shea, and he would come home on the weekend, like Friday, Saturday night, he'd go out, he'd come in with two, three guys, and it would be like two o'clock in the morning, and he would say, hey, read that script, read Dumb and Dumber, oh, come on, he goes, read it, come on, he'd have these guys I didn't even know, and I'd be like, all right, and I would read, like, from beginning to end, I'd read the entire script, like a movie, in an hour and a half, I would just fly through it, the entire thing, and I would have these guys howling on the ground, laughing their butts off. And it, I must have done this 15 times where he came with new police. He said, hey, read it for these guys. I'm like, oh, come on. He goes, read it. Like, All right. So I did it. And so I was positive that it was good. <laughs> I was positive that this is a good thing. And then when we get Jim and Jeff, and you saw the chemistry they had, yeah. it never occurred to me once during the making of that movie that this wasn't a little classic, to be honest.